welcome to another Axe Expert video. It's me again, Catherine and Dr. Johnson. Yeah, How so let's doing? be good. <laughs> awesome, awesome. What is our question for today? Ask, but it's not really a question. It's more like a story. I've been like, I wanted to tell you about it and see what's the best option. So my uncle called me like a couple weeks ago and he was saying to me, hey, you know, I went to see a dentist and he's super scared now because they're saying that he's gonna like probably lose all his teeth because it's like gum disease he's having gum disease he's been ashamed about it for a while so you know you don't really smile that much but they're, they're telling me that he's gonna lose his teeth and um, it's all because of this the bleeding that he's having the build up all that stuff like what do you think is gonna like what's the best option do you think he should do take the teeth out and just get dentures or we can repair somehow you think yeah so it's i mean having your own teeth is always the best way to go told me that yeah <laughs> so if we can save teeth mm -hmm. that's the way we want to go so gum disease unfortunately you lose a lot of the bone around your tooth and it makes it loose okay. and when it gets loose like that you end up having to pull the teeth out okay. but there is one thing that it's like your last resort that you can really try as long as you're a candidate for it and okay. most people are a candidate for it and it's a laser procedure it's called LANAP Okay. And it actually is FDA approved to grow bone back and to stick that gum tissue back on your tooth. Okay. Um, so how the process works is in the past, I used to do it 20 years ago where we would do it with surgery. Mm -hmm. We cut the gum, mm -hmm. we'd move it away from the teeth, we'd clean everything up and we'd stitch the gum tissue back. Okay. So obviously you can imagine that's very painful and it's, it's no painful. fun <laughs> and patients hate it. Okay. But it's their only chance of keeping their teeth. Right. But this procedure, instead of cutting the gum, you use a laser to go into the gum pockets mm -hmm. and you kill the bacteria, you remove all the dead tissue that's on your gums, mm -hmm. and you expose the new fresh tissue. You clean up everything underneath, the buildup, and then you use the laser again to form a blood clot that sticks your tissue against the tooth. Okay. And that blood clot has your own stem cells in it. Mm -hmm. So it stimulates the bone to grow. So that's why it's FDA approved to grow some bone back. Oh, so we'll okay. get cases where teeth are loose mm -hmm. and um, we do the procedure. We also fix the bite so you're not biting heavy on your teeth. And that tooth is not loose anymore because the tissue has stuck back onto the tooth mm -hmm. and the bone has started to grow. Now you're not gonna grow 100% of the bone back. Right? It's not like a miracle it's word, not but. A miracle, right, right. <laughs> but you're growing enough bone to stabilize that tooth that you can then keep that tooth or those teeth again and you don't have to pull your teeth out. Okay, okay. So that sounds like a better idea though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and how invasive is it? Like, um, are they going to have like a lot of um, homework to do at home versus um, is this a one-time deal or is it something that they're going to have to continuously doing over time like in the next six months to a year yeah like so no it's a one-time procedure okay. but there is homework to do at home you have to still make sure you're brushing flossing using water pick keeping it clean because the same stuff that got stuck underneath there is going to cause the same problem okay right so we can fix the problem that's here now and then you maintain it well afterwards and then you don't have to do this laser procedure again over and over again so i would just come for my regular cleanings correct okay yeah and would I have to do more adjustments? Because I heard you said adjustment earlier for like yes. biting. So sometimes we will have to adjust the bite because as the bone grows in, the tooth shifts just a tiny little bit and it changes your bite. So we want to change the bite so we can make it even mm -hmm. so that it's not banging on the teeth and preventing the bone from regrowing. Perfect. You know what? I probably need to let him come and see you because sure. you're saying take out the teeth and you're giving me a way new technology innovative thing. That sounds like a plan. So we sure. can save that teeth, right? We can definitely save more teeth than we used to. Right, right, right. So laser is actually one of our options now, guys. Yep. So let's come on down, talk to Dr. Johnson, and let's see if we can get that done.